Christian Tom Morello, also at the anti-NATO protest, was the Reverend Jesse Jackson of Rainbow Push Coalition, which is based here in Chicago. I asked him about the significance of the NATO summit and the protests. You know, people are here from around the world searching for, searching for alternatives to war. Uh, war seems to be expanding. People seem to have accepted NATO as a defensive organization, defense against Soviet expansion in the Europe, allowing Europe to restabilize as it has, and to keep the uh, Germans from rearming. So the Soviet Union is gone. Germany is now an ally. Europe is stable again in the military and in, in an economic sense. Uh, but here we are today. Uh, we, we went. We ventured into Iraq on the wrong target. Three trillion dollars in lives and money lost. What could a trillion dollars do today? Why would every state budget deficit? The 750,000 public workers lost could get their jobs back. So it, it, the misadventure is very costly. Now we seek to go in to expand a long-term commitment to Afghanistan. Two to four billion dollars a week. When we're laying off transfer workers, closing schools and closing hospitals. We can't afford it. It is a mission not worthy of the investment. I hope people who are here today will remain nonviolent and disciplined and focused. The media would rather cover a brick than to cover the message. When, when the nurses say health care, not warfare, that's the message. When the veterans say when we come home, we come home to a home. The veterans deserve a, a lifetime health care, a place to stay, a job and education. That message should not be lost. And if that message is affirmed, I think American people will embrace that message. The Reverend Jesse Jackson of the Rainbow Push Coalition, based here in Chicago. And that does it for our broadcast. If you'd like to get a copy, you can go to our website at democracynow.org, where the transcripts of the whole show will be up, as well as the video and audio uh, podcasts. Tell your friends they can go to democracynow.org. Democracy Now! is produced by a remarkable team. Our crew here in Chicago, Mike Burke, Hani Massoud, Dennis Moynihan, and John Hamilton. In New